Hello, Prim friends. Well, I'm coming to you again from a very popular shop from one of our earlier videos. We are at Sawdust and Stitches in Waynesville, Ohio. They are, I'm here now, right before their Christmas open house begins. When you see this video, the Christmas open house days will have already taken place. Items, some of the real specialty items may have already gone, but don't hesitate. Give them a call or best thing you can do is come on over next year. Put this place on your calendar for shopping for these amazing prims. These couple, pe there are a few pieces here that are so incredibly charming. They are handmade by a woman, a local artisan. She puts so much effort into them, all very unique. Look at this gorgeous little snow girl. This snowman up here, I understand there is a Santa somewhere in the shop, so we will go around and check for him. But I am so excited to be here at the shop today. Um, I have my parents here with me. We spent a wonderful night last night in Lebanon at the Golden Lamb. And um, family friends are here as well to shop today. So just a beautiful prim shop. And you know, I wanted to mention something as well we were just talking about this morning. How many times I have said, you know, the... 200th anniversary of our country, the 1776-1976, really created a resurgence of our American country furniture and that um, early American look and history. Well, in just a couple of years, we will be celebrating 250 years. So what an amazing opportunity to perhaps get some more people excited about this, you know, our historic look. This is, this is our history. These little snow people are so adorable. Wonderful quilts. So Tammy does ship but um, again, some of these very specialty Christmas pieces may be gone that you are seeing here today. And perhaps you are going to be here at the open house uh, this weekend. Look at that wonderful mantle with the socks. They are so cute. Now, I don't have a mantle at my house, but I may have to find a spot for those because they are absolutely precious. The signs, um, I am so excited with mine that we will be putting up in our kitchen. That is a wonderful shelf. Love that. Horse-drawn sleigh rides. Yeah, Tammy has some really wonderful artisans that create so many of these pieces here and her antiques that she chooses are just really incredible pieces. Love that early tin candle there with the little nubby and then the little scissors to cut. Beautiful basket with the with the little pillows. That is a really nice, look at that table with that blue-green, small, round. My goodness, her prices are really wonderful. That one is marked $1.95. She does have upholstered furniture as well. That is a nice shelf. I like that. I know back here in the corner is a room decorated sort of a, as a tavern. We'll go back here. Love the, the long red union suits. They're so charming. Pretty cabinet with the mirror. 
And here the tavern room with all the signs, the checkerboards, like that tin, punched tin hat. Love it. What a fun, fun space, fun, wonderful place to go, go shopping for pieces to add to your home. The signs, my husband chose one also that is now in his office. So we really, we really enjoyed our fall shopping trip here and now we're I'm excited about shopping for Christmas once the doors actually open. Um, I'm blessed to come in to be able to video ahead, but I won't cut in line on any of the on any of the shopping. Cigars and tobacco. Love the signs. Look at these wonderful floors in this shop. Here another sweet creature there, little critter. I love the, those wonderful brooms. Oh my goodness. Gorgeous. Laws of Ohio book. What a charming little corner. Black Horse Tavern and Inn. Textiles, woolens, Great signs for a rug hooker or a sewer. There might be a couple of those with me here today. Just beautiful pieces, look at that. Blackened pears, those wax pears, those are, no. I'm not sure what those are. They're lightweight, so shipping wouldn't be an issue there. Love the pantry cakes. Oh, look at the little snow girl. She's so cute. I love the carrot nose. And all the snowman picks here in the milk container. It's wonderful gingerbread men and the trees are just so wonderful filled with all the bells and the little stockings the rusty bells there <laughs> the snowman gourd up on the top with the little wheelbarrow and the sleepy mouse Here. The little greens with the mittens. And here, this is what you are greeted with when you first walk in the door. And Tammy's family is a military family that has settled in. This Waynesville Dayton area is always special to my heart. Um, Monday being Veterans Day. Big shout out to all of those who have given of themselves for that service. The Merry Christmas signs. Look at the green shutters there on the on the wall. So I want to shout out for a couple other shows or, or open houses Christmas coming up. Um, Seville Antiques. Now Waynesville is um, near the Dayton, Ohio area. We are, my shop is it located inside Seville Antiques. And this was about, I would say, a three and a half hour drive down from there. So if you're using Seville as a um, as a reference point for the distance, that's about what I would say, about three and a half hours. But absolutely well worth the road trip. Um, I'll do a video of our stay at the Golden Lamb. Wonderful meals, 
Um, we've just had a wonderful couple of days on this uh, fun little road trip to come down to this area of, of the state for shopping. Jones and Dairy Milk, Butter and Eggs. Look at that beautiful corner cabinet. Love it. And the ladder. I really want to do something like this over our kitchen sink. So I see it again and again. Just have to figure out how we're going to get that hung on our, in that area. Oh, look at the Santa sign. Yeah, I think some of those will have to come home with me. This one with the little woolen, the woolen Christmas tree. So cute. There's a boxwood wreath. We saw that when we came down um, at the Patriot shop. The boxwood wreaths. Fresh, fresh and salt meats. I like that red, that red wooden shelf there on the, on the wall. If I remember from my last visit, she said everything in the shop is available for sale. So if you see something that is available and she does ship. So even the cabinets that are used for display, those are, those are all available for sale and her prices are wonderful do you see the little um graters down here those are so cute with the little flicker candles in underneath them um, they really make a beautiful display on an evening the way the light will shine through those pantry Feed and Seed Company. Love the g little garland of the gourds. Early homestead candles. They do have the scents, the spice samplers, and the little hand poured candles, the little nubbies. The, um, the little wreaths for around your chandeliers. Oh, so cute. And then of course the lighting pieces as well and more candles. So I will, like I said, make sure that the contact information is available on the screen and in the description and I hope you will check them out. What did you see that absolutely just said you need to have that come home with you? Well, take care, everyone. I'm seeing a line forming outside. It's probably still about a half an hour before the shop opens today for their Christmas open house. Take care, and we will see you in the next one lots more Christmas videos coming. Make sure you hit subscribe and give us a thumbs up. Take care. We'll see you in the next one.